keeping your faith and keeping your walk with God and staying firm in that foundation you have in Christ and letting vengeance be God's, letting the battle be God's and walking out with him until you get to the battlefield. And then once you get to that point, God has given your enemies enough rope to hang themselves. Come on. For lack of a better term. Like so they Jesus. literally, as they're fighting against you and they're coming against you and they're beating you over Come the on. head and they're slandering you and they're coming at you with everything they have. And God's like, hang on, just hang on, just hang on. Your character will come out, I'll shine through you, and the next thing you know, they've dug a hole big enough to bury themselves in. He is your defender. He is Jehovah Nisi, the Lord who fights for you. And Haman's gallows, he, the gallows he created for everyone else, he was hung on his own gallows. I don't know, maybe God's speaking to somebody tonight, I mean, or who will watch this at some point future, uh, that you've got enemies, you've got people that are opposing you, and, and adversaries and all that kind of stuff. Just trust God. Just, just don't, don't fight your battle. Don't go, don't go rogue. Don't go tit for tat. Just let God handle it. I promise you, He does it.